All right, here's our main switches. The fly mentor is in um, balance mode here. Click that off, and we're in the secondary mode. If we click this one off, You'll now see the fly minter is off completely. As you can see by the swash plate, nothing's happening. We turn it back on and the swash plate will correct. So now we'll do a in flight and show you it working. I can talk, but you don't talk. Alright, here's the fly minter. The positions are into the both switches up. Uh, we've got to wait for a second. Up, and we are in balance mode. This is where the chopper doesn't hold its position. You can see it'll wander, but it corrects it. And you actually can sub trim it out with your trim. But it's very stable and it corrects. It automatically levels out. These can be in position. Now the flip of a switch will go into um, position hold. Now it takes a picture of the ground and it's going to try to hold that position. This is it correcting on its own. I am not. Let's move it back away. Let's, let's land it there for a second. Turn it off. I'm going to go into the screen. Right. Here we go again. Taking off. This is the fly minnow off. As you can see it's quite responsive and doesn't do anything. Click. We've got the gyros are on, it'll wander, but it will try to re-level. Alright, now position hold. You can see it's correcting on its own. I am not doing anything with the radio. And it's trying to hold its position. And I've got it turned way up, so you kind of see that it is working. get it out there. It's looking for contrast there. But now, and it's fighting me actually. It doesn't want to move off that spot. So I'll go into balance mode and I've got control again. Alrighty, so we're going to set her down. and a little more fine tuning to go. All right, turn it off.